Hey, what is up, everybody? Michael Crump here yet again, talking about all of the latest and the greatest in PlayStation 4 homebrew news and much, much more. Today, I wanted to tell you that Golden version 2.1.1 has been out. Now, I've been asked a couple of times in my forums if I was going to cover this update. And I decided right here, kind of at the last moment, that I was going to cover it. But keep in mind that this is more of a bug fix release versus new features, especially that we just saw in version 2.1, where it added the ability to have a configuration file to save our settings if we turned on our FTP or our bin loader. You should check out that video if you haven't already. Okay, so here I am. I'm on the official gold hand side. And if we just scroll down here, you'll see for version 2.1.1 that it says that it fixed multiple injections. Now, people all over Reddit and a bunch of other places have been asking, what exactly does that mean? And I'm going to show you exactly what that means in just a moment. So let's go down to assets first. And I am just going to click on the very latest and greatest Golden version 2.1.1, and it is now on my hard disk drive. So just like every release for Golden, you can use 5.05 all the way to 6.x to 7.x, as well as there is the 9.00 bin. So the 9.00 bin is what I'm going to use today with my ESP32 device, which I absolutely love. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and put this on my ESP32 device. So here I am. I'm in my admin. There is file uploader. I'm just going to simply select my file and then press on upload files. And now that latest version of Golden is now on my ESP32 device and it is ready to serve it to my PlayStation 4. Now, in order to show you the bug fix, I think it's worth at least pointing out what the bug actually is. So let's go ahead. We'll go into my user guide here, helpful info, and I've already connected to my ESP32 device. And now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and run the Golden version 2.1. Again, this is the older version 2.1, not the newest version, which is 2.1.1. Okay, we're going to insert our USB drive. All right, and it has now been removed. And now we are on Golden version 2.1. Okay. So this bug actually occurs when you are switching users. So we're going to need to do that in just a moment. First, let's go to settings and let's go down to where it says system. And then let's go to system information. And right here, as you can see, we're on Golden version 2.1. Now pay special attention to where it shows the Golden version 2.1 with a star. And then it says coded by Sistro. Let's go ahead now and let's switch the current user. So I'm going to switch user and then I'm going to go into MB Crump 2. And now let's head all the way back over into our settings here. And then we'll go down to where it says system again. And then finally system information. And there is the bug. As you can see, Golden version 2.1, it's already been loaded one time, and it appears a second time because I switched a user. So let's go ahead and let's try changing the user once again, and let's see what happens here. So we'll go switch user, and this time we'll switch back to my main account. And let's head back over into settings, and it basically should add yet another one. 
So we'll go to system information and there we go. And I believe that this can occur multiple times. So this has obviously been corrected now with the very latest Gold 10 version 2.1.1. So I have rebooted my PlayStation 4 and now I'm going to go into settings, user guide, helpful info. We're going to run the very latest Gold Hen, which was just released, which is the 2.1.1. And I did get this message uh, two times while testing this. I'm not sure why, but just press OK there. And then if you run the payload again, and we will insert our USB drive, And now we will press OK and now remove it. Okay, so now that the latest version has been loaded, if we go back in and we try to switch users now, then that obviously won't occur anymore. So let's go to system, let's go to system information, and we see the latest Gold Hen version 2.1.1. Let's go ahead and try it real quick by switching to users. So we're going to go to MB Crump 2 and now back over to settings, system, and then finally system information. And there it goes. It has been corrected. We'll go ahead and we'll switch back to my main account. And let's go into this account right here. And we'll swing back into settings and then into system, and then finally system information. And so that is just about it, folks. That is what that mysterious message was that was in the change log. That is what it corrected. Now, should you upgrade? Why not? Go ahead and use the latest and greatest Gold Hen. That's what I will be doing. I will be running Gold Hen version 2.1.1 going forward, and you might as well take advantage of any of the newest, latest, and greatest improvements in the system. And if you are looking for a site that already supports the very latest and greatest Gold Hen version 2.1.1, I would highly recommend coming over here and checking out Chameleon's site. It's just listed right here as a link. I'll also put a link to it down below, but... They are extremely fast to update their host with kind of whatever is currently happening. And with that being said, thank you so very much for watching. I greatly appreciate each and every one of you. I'll see you on the next one. Michael, out!